One of my favorite parts of the day is our family dinner. We gather. My daughter, she sets the table. My wife puts food on the table. We get our beverages, and we sit down. We hold hands, and we like to sing a song of thanks for our food. And we check in. Sometimes there's laughter, a little banter, some teasing, even an argument. It's a ritual that's important in my life. It's also about connection. It's about a heart connection with the people that we love. Imagine if a meal, a family dinner, could save somebody from overdosing, from opiates. Imagine that. Why is this relevant? A few years ago, I was asked to do a lecture at a middle school on substance use prevention. And all of the research I went to, all of the web pages, everything talked about the importance of five family meals a week. And I was really blown away. I said, there's got to be more to it, and there is. But the most prevalent piece was five family meals meals a week. So I'd like to ask the first three rows of the audience to please stand up. This is how many young adults we are losing a day to opiate overdoses. Thank you, please sit down. We can stop it before it starts sometime. It's a bad day when families have to come into my office and tell me they just identified their child's body. Bad day. In Gloucester, Massachusetts, they're no longer arresting heroin addicts. They're offering them free treatment. 32 years ago, I was homeless. You didn't want to be around me. And I stand before you today, 32 years later, a restored human being. So. I want to challenge you guys. Let's have some artful meals. Five family meals a week. Let's save some lives. Thank you.